Hello guys, welcome to Filament Daily. Today I will show you three tricks, three things how to make your forms shorter in space. So we've been working on one of the filament examples and this was the first draft that the colleague prepared for me. And we often do it this way, just share ideas, build some first version and then improve on that. So the task was to have same as billing checkbox which hides the shipping address which is pretty typical for order forms in eShops. So the functionality is working it actually does what it should do and it's actually live it's free on our filamentexamples.com here order shipping address same as billing and i will link that in the description below as well it's free no need any payment or membership but in this video i want to focus on this size of the form you would probably agree that it takes too much space both vertically and horizontally so how to make it a bit shorter or maybe not a bit shorter. First thing that we can do is to not allow the full horizontal space for each field and we can do it by shortening it with column span for each field. But in here we have two sections and we can add column span to each of them separately. So have section make shipping details and section make billing details. So let's add column span one by default it is two so column span one here actually let's refresh and i'll show you what that does it does this one it is on the left and takes only half of the screen and then if we add the same column span one to the shipping details Ta-da! we have saved horizontal space and if we click same as billing it appears here on the right now which is already a huge improvement no need to scroll for the form to be visible. But also another thing I saw is these labels are repeatable. So billing address, billing this, billing that, then shipping this, shipping that. Whereas actually title and the label is on top of the section. So billing details. And all we need is address, postcode and city. And they don't necessarily need to be labels. We can use placeholders. So for example, let's change the billing address to have a placeholder for just address, which would look like this we have address here and then we don't need that label because we have billing here and address in here so then we add also hidden label and we refresh and we have saved quite a lot of space now let's repeat the same thing for other inputs placeholder hidden label we copy and paste into postcode and others one by one yep so i've done it behind the scenes to save you time and i refresh and this is the form now three inputs close to each other with placeholders and if we click that the shape of the form doesn't really change it doesn't become vertical it fits on the screen pretty well so yeah compare visually this version with the original version which took the full of the screen. Personally, I'm not a UX specialist or professional, but it looks much better to me with just three things. Column span, here, placeholder for the fields and hidden label. What do you think about this improvement in general? And what else would you advise to improve that form in terms of spacing, horizontal and vertical? What tricks you used with filament in your projects? Let's discuss and share the knowledge in the comments below. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.